God has unlimited power. Our daily bread. Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Jennifer Benson Schultz. In a field on an English countryside, G.K. Chesterton stood up from where he had been sitting and exploded with laughter. His outburst was so sudden and so loud, the cows could not take their eyes off him. Just minutes before, the Christian writer and apologist had been miserable. That afternoon, he had been wandering the hills, sketching pictures on brown paper, using colored chalks. But he was dismayed to discover he had no white chalk, which he considered to be essential to his artwork. Soon, though, he began to laugh when he realized that the ground beneath him was porous limestone, the earth's equivalent of white chalk. He broke off a piece and resumed drawing. Like Chesterton, who realized he was sitting on an immense warehouse of white chalk, believers have God's unlimited spiritual resources within reach at all times. His divine power has given us everything we need for a godly life through our knowledge of Him. Maybe you feel you're lacking some important element necessary for godliness, such as faith, grace, or wisdom. If you know Christ, you have everything you need and more. Through Jesus, you have access to the Father, the one who graciously provides believers with all things. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from 2 Peter chapter 1, verses 1-10. through 10. Simon Peter, a servant and apostle of Jesus Christ, to those who through the righteousness of our God and Savior Jesus Christ have received a faith as precious as ours, grace and peace be yours in abundance through the knowledge of God and of Jesus our Lord. His divine power has given us everything we need for a godly life through our knowledge of Him who called us by His own glory and goodness. Through these, He has given us His very great and precious promises, so that through them you may participate in the divine nature, having escaped the corruption in the world caused by evil desires. For this very reason, make every effort to add to your faith goodness, and to goodness knowledge, and to knowledge self-control, and to self-control perseverance, and to perseverance godliness, and to godliness mutual affection, and to mutual affection love. For if you possess these qualities in increasing measure, they will keep you from being ineffective and unproductive in your knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. But whoever does not have them is nearsighted and blind, forgetting that they have been cleansed from their past sins. Therefore, my brothers and sisters, make every effort to confirm your calling and election. For if you do these things, you will never stumble. That's today's scripture reading from 2 Peter chapter 1, verses 1-10. through 10. And now let's pray. Dear Lord, forgive me for overlooking your power and trying to live in my own strength. I can't do it. Thank you for providing everything I need. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.